Apollo 11 was the space flight that first landed humans on the moon. Commander Neil Armstrong and Lunar Module pilot Buzz Aldrin formed the American crew that landed the Apollo Lunar Module Eagle on July 20, 1969, at 2017 UTC. Armstrong became the first person to step onto the lunar surface 6 hours and 39 minutes later on July 21 at 2.56 UTC, Aldrin joined him 19 minutes later. They spent about two and a quarter hours together outside the spacecraft, and they collected 47.5 pounds kilograms, of lunar material to bring back to Earth. Command Module pilot Michael Collins flew the Command Module Columbia alone in lunar orbit while they were on the moon's surface. Armstrong and Aldrin spent 21 hours, 36 minutes on the lunar surface at a site they named Tranquility Base before lifting off to rejoin Columbia in lunar orbit. Apollo 11 was launched by a Saturn V rocket from Kennedy Space Center on Merritt Island, Florida, on July 16 at 13.32 UTC, and it was the fifth crewed mission of NASA's Apollo program. The Apollo project was enabled by NASA's adoption of new advances in semiconductor electronic technology, including metal oxide semiconductor field effect transistors in the interplanetary monitoring platform and silicon integrated circuit chips in the Apollo guidance computer. In October 1968, Apollo 7 evaluated the command module in Earth orbit, and in December Apollo 8 tested it in lunar orbit. In March 1969, Apollo 9 put the lunar module through its paces in Earth orbit, and in May Apollo 10 conducted a dress rehearsal in lunar orbit. On July 13, three days before Apollo 11's launch, the Soviet Union launched Luna 15, which reached lunar orbit before Apollo 11. Due to design and manufacturing delays in the LM, Apollo 8 and Apollo 9 swapped prime and backup crews, and Armstrong's crew became the backup for Apollo 8. Lovell took his place on the Apollo 8 crew, and when Collins recovered he joined Armstrong's crew as SMP. In the meantime, Fred Hayes filled in as backup LMP, and Aldrin as backup SMP for Apollo 8. Apollo 11 was the second American mission where all the crew members had prior spaceflight experience, the first being Apollo 10. The Apollo 11 Prime crew had none of the close cheerful camaraderie characterized by that of Apollo 12. By the normal crew rotation in place during Apollo, Lovell, Mattingly, and Hayes were scheduled to fly on Apollo 14 after backing up for Apollo 11. The Apollo 11 mission emblem was designed by Collins, who wanted a symbol for peaceful lunar landing by the United States. After the crew of Apollo 10 named their spacecraft Charlie Brown and Snoopy, assistant manager for public affairs Julian Shear wrote to George M. Lowe, the manager of the Apollo spacecraft program office at the MSC, to suggest the Apollo 11 crew be less flippant in naming their craft. During the first press conference after the Apollo 11 crew was announced, the first question was, which one of you gentlemen will be the first man to step onto the lunar surface? Slayton told the reporter it had not been decided, and Armstrong added that it was not based on individual desire. There were several differences between Eagle and Apollo 10's LM4 Snoopy, Eagle had a VHF radio antenna to facilitate communication with the astronauts during their EVA on the lunar surface, a lighter ascent engine, more thermal protection on the landing gear, and a package of scientific experiments known as the Early Apollo Scientific Experiments Package. Saturn V AS506 launched Apollo 11 on July 16, 1969, at 13.32 UTC. At 13.2 seconds into the flight, the launch vehicle began to roll into its flight azimuth of 72.058 degrees. On July 19 at 17.21 and 50 seconds UTC, Apollo 11 passed behind the moon and fired its service propulsion engine to enter lunar orbit. Presidential speechwriter William Sapphire had prepared an event of moon disaster announcement for Nixon to read in the event the Apollo 11 astronauts were stranded on the moon. The aircraft carrier USS Hornet, under the command of Captain Carl J. Seiblick, was selected as the primary recovery ship for Apollo 11 on June 5, replacing its sister ship, the LPH USS Princeton, which had recovered Apollo 10 on May 26. This practice would continue for two more Apollo missions, Apollo 12 and Apollo 14, before the moon was proven to be barren of life, 
and the quarantine process dropped. Many nations honored the first human moon landing with special features in magazines or by issuing Apollo 11 commemorative postage stamps or coins. The success of Apollo 11 demonstrated the United States' technological superiority, and with the success of Apollo 11, America had won the space race. While Apollo 11 sparked the interest of the world, the follow-on Apollo missions did not hold the interest of the nation. After the Apollo 11 mission, officials from the Soviet Union said landing humans on the moon was dangerous and unnecessary. The Apollo 11 landing is referenced in the songs Armstrong, Aldrin and Collins by the Birds on the 1969 album Ballad of Easy Rider and Coon on the Moon by Howlin' Wolf on the 1973 album The Backdoor Wolf. In November 1969, Nixon asked NASA to make up about 250 presentation Apollo 11 lunar sample displays for 135 nations, the 50 states of the United States and its possessions, and the United Nations. The Apollo 11 lunar sample displays were given out as goodwill gifts by Nixon in 1970.